PQ is diameter of circle with center of. The tangents at R needs PQ produced at A. If RPQ is 27 degree, then measure of RQP is. Here, this is the circle with center O. Now, PQ is a diameter. PQ is the diameter. And, here tangents at R means PQ produced at A. Tangents at R means this point R must be on the circumference of the circle. We don't know where is point R. So, it can be anywhere on the circumference. Now, angle RPQ is 27 degree. Which means this RPQ angle is 27 degree. Then, you can see this is diameter PQ. So, diameter can create angle 90 degree with any point of the circumference of the circle. Which means this point R is on the circumference of the circle means this angle. PRQ is 90 degree. If PRQ is 90 degree, we need what is RQP. That is this angle. This is 90. 90 plus 27 is equal to 117. So, remaining will be 63. 63 degree. So, option 1 is your answer. Actually, you don't need to draw the tangents here. That is to mislead the question. That is, here tangents at R means PQ produced at A. Here, if this is the tangents, the, this is the tangents, this tangents will meet PQ produced at A. Consider we are extending this PQ. Now, this is point A. Then tangents meet here. Actually, we don't need this part. That is to mislead you. To confuse your diagram.